Hello, everybody out there. Mike, along with my brother Chris behind the camera. We from Comic Frontline here, and welcome to a unboxing video of a video game that I'm going to show in this video. Um, in this video, I'm I'm going to be unboxing. Aliens Colonial Marine. Now, why don't you explain? Because I know a lot of people right now want to be like, wait a minute, that game is like five dollars on yeah. Amazon. Actually, this collector's edition only cost Michael nineteen ninety nine. Yeah. And when it was released, it was actually seventy or eighty bucks. Yes. And here's the reason <coughs> why I am showing this is because me and my brother decided on our group channel, which is Brooklyn Boys Thirteen, we're going to do. Uh, the worst games in the past current years. In the past current years. Now, uh, Chris agreed to do Aliens Colonial Marines. Play it. To play it. Whereas I decided to play for the PlayStation 3 Duke Nukem Forever. <laughs> and I didn't get the collector's edition, I just got the regular one. So. Well, there's a reason for that, but that's a future video. Yes, yeah, so, oh boy, I'm looking forward to this. I think I have the better deal here, yeah. to be honest. But. With all that, let's get to the collector's edition. I'm gonna zoom away from your face now. I'm going here. Yeah. I like the box design. For, yeah, uh, this part comes off if you want, so you don't have to have the aliens. See? Yeah. But I left it on. I put no. I kept the tape on on the bottom. Yeah. So, the back shows you everything you get. Yep. So I just want to show all the signs. You could also get it for the signs. Xbox 360. You could put it down and then open it up yeah. and do it one so piece I'll at a time. That. So I'm gonna show you what this comes with. So, first of all, let's get the uh, game out of the way, which is right here for the PlayStation 3 of Aliens Colonial Marines. And with the game, a little lower now, remember oh. the camera's lower now. Oh. Yeah. It doesn't know. have your face anymore, it's literally oh, okay, I didn't thing. know what a camera With was. this, it also comes with the Aliens Colonial Marines, um... Oh, what's this called? Yeah, I'll show this Playable scene. iconic characters from the original Aliens film, additional customization for Marines and competitive uh, multiplayer, and Ripley's Flamethrower DLC. Yep. And you also get the Colonial Marines Sonic Electronic Ball Breaker and Phase Plasma Rifle to confront hordes of enemies in competitive multiplayer, and the USCM Academy Firing Range level to on your um, skills before going into battle DLC. Yes. So you get some levels and extra customization and you get some extra characters as well as some DLC um, events. reason I'm showing it off camera is because we uh, didn't redeem them yet but we will be yes. redeeming them. So that's one part of what we got. Um, also in here we got badges. Yeah, badges right here which look really nice. I'm actually uh, I'm the glad we got these. Like, like we have uh, badges on our There's walls. There's two. You get this one, which so, is the yeah. one that's on the shoulders, and this one, which is on the actual uniform. And it actually says right here, uh, for application on USCM uh, battle dress utilities, um, must apply to uniform before entering battle. So this is very official. Yeah. It's good for a display on the walls, like. Yeah, like what we did we on our wall already. Right. Okay. I think that's. There's just a folder left. Just check to make yeah. sure. And there's this also. Other side. Show oh, the other side too. Yeah, the other side. I was going to classify. Show the other side. Yep. Inside that is a lot of nice yeah, stuff. Yeah, this one, um, I want to really show all of you what comes inside of here. So, inside. Let's move the folder a little. Yeah. yeah. Did you do that last. Yeah. That one's hard to open. Just show the other stuff. Oh, yeah. So, we have like all the schematics and stuff. No, we'll show it one piece at a time. Give me. Well, one. Yeah, I was trying. Okay. A photograph of LV-426 environment. The eggs, they make it look like an old Polaroid camera picture. Yep. An old printout, which is a um, mission briefing. Yeah, that one's really This is nice. Cool. Yeah. And that's the bed. That's the piece that is these stones. Let me, let me lift it up a little bit. That is the Sephora um, plan. Shows you the entire layout of the ship. Uh, and it's on a clear paper. Yeah, I was actually... That's something that's worth um, putting somewhere, but I would definitely say frame it because the, pa the paper is very yeah, thin. Yeah, because it's very delicate and it could rip... Uh, so there's the easy. schematics. There's a poster for joining the army. Yep, right here. Be the face of your country, you as colonial marines. Horrible And game. also there is a... Uh, yeah, you put your name and everything. Certificate that... that um, 
But that's only if you, you want completed to. your Colonial Marine Academy training. Yep. We're not putting our name on it. But no, we're not gonna put our name on it. Indeed. Okay, so that's that. Let me just fix this up and put this on the side here as well. Uh, you know what? Put it on top. So that way we could show the next big thing here. Wait, wait. Take the take that. Yeah, put that on the table. Yeah, just get that. Oh, there's a bottom piece. You have to lift. Yeah, oh, there you go. Yeah. Okay, now so you let's put, put this. this here. You can use down. this as a background if you so choose. Oh, you don't have the to. First. There you go. Okay. And for this background, you can use this statue, which came directly from the Aliens movie scene of... Uh, Not just a movie. That's part of the... Well, that's... I, I love... It. It's I ironic. Know. It's actually ironic. This was meant for... From Aliens... No, no, no. It opens. Oh, all right. So, it's ironic that they show this. You only get to play in the machine like twice and for a brief couple of moments. And you never really get to use it again. A lot of people were complaining about that with this game. But it's a really nice statue. I'll give you guys. I'll zoom out and I'll zoom in. Yeah, I mean, it's a really uh, great design. It's it sculpted very nicely. Just Alien. like from the movie. And the detail on it is like really outstanding. One thing I can say, this was worth, this itself, just this was worth the 20 bucks. Absolutely. Back, you got all the wiring and whatnot. You got the alien. The alien's in perfect detail. And I'm glad I actually got the statue because this was actually one of my favorite scenes from the aliens movie when she used a wow. robot just to defeat the alien. Like, that was just really amazing. To this day, still. In that perfect sense. detail. Yeah. Even with this background, that's. It even has the light. Yeah, the light that goes on to show that the machine... But this happening. is not Ripley, Mike. You do know that this is the Colonial Marine you play oh, as. Oh, I know. Okay. Yeah. I, kn I knew that. Okay. I'm just saying it's... So like you can actually take the background. Take the background away now. Yeah. You can put it back in the box. Put that back here. Yep. And uh, that's all that this comes with. This I forgot to take out. Yeah. So that's all. That's... All this comes with so hopefully uh, this video was helpful for you guys to get the collector's edition as well as uh, the game itself you can just open you just open it just open and then it it'll stand on its own after that yeah, yeah. and that's all that uh, comes with um, expect this once again on our group channel which will be broken boys 13 of both this and duke nukem forever just want to point that i out i would again. like to point out since i'm the one playing this game the collector's edition is yeah, worth be playing it, by the, way. the collector's edition is worth the 20 dollars from amazon strictly for the statue the collectible stuff and the badges mm -hmm. the game itself if you buy it alone i believe it's five to ten dollars depending what system you want that's about as much as the game is worth. To be honest, though, for the extra couple of dollars to get the yeah. DLC that comes with the Collector's Edition plus the extras, uh, I would recommend getting the extras just to have the extras, especially because it's so dirt cheap right now. Very. Um, Duke Nukem's was a little bit more pricey. That's why we didn't get the Collector's Edition for that. But um, the game is not as good as everybody thought it was going to be. There's already another Aliens game in the making, so we'll if that, that says anything goes. to you. And ironically... Aliens Colonial Marines, made by Gearbox. Guess what Duke Nukem Forever is made by? Same. Gearbox. So. so. Gearbox, get your gears in gear. Is the next Alien Games from? I don't know. Oh, we don't know. All right. All right, so that's all uh, there is here. Uh, uh, so to wrap up this video, don't forget to check out Comic and ComicFrontline.com. Together, we are number one source for Comic Relay news, views, and a whole bunch more. Subscribe here on Comic Frontline, where we have lots of stuff. Uh, and videos for futures and all that and comment below what your thoughts are for aliens clone marines and uh, anything else so until next time mike and chris from comic frontline take care and keep watching later guys bye everybody